Children's Books Read Aloud by Happy Cultivated. Today's book, A Little Golden Book, Cars. Lightning McQueen was a race car. He was flashy red and had a shiny lightning bolt on his side. He even had adoring fans. But he also had a big problem. His pit crews kept quitting. You see, McQueen thought he could do everything by himself. And since all McQueen cared about was winning races, he didn't have any friends. Except Mac. Mac the truck drove McQueen to all his races. One night, McQueen wanted to get to a really big race, really fast. He made Mac drive too long, and the loyal truck got tired. Mac swerved, and McQueen fell out the back of the truck. Uh-oh. McQueen had been sleeping, but he woke up fast. The race car was lost and scared. Soon he was racing toward an old forgotten town called Radiator Springs. The sheriff chased McQueen. McQueen was scared, so he drove faster. He knocked into just about everything in the little town. What a mess. When the chase was over, McQueen had ruined the town's main street. He was in a heap of trouble. In fact, the sheriff had him towed to jail for all the damage he had done. Only one car in town was friendly to McQueen, a rusty tow truck named Mater. Mater didn't know that McQueen was a famous car. He just wanted to make a new friend. Soon, McQueen was brought to court. He thought he would be set free because he was a superstar race car. He was right, almost. Doc, the town's judge, told McQueen to leave town and never come back. He didn't like race cars. Then Sally, a blue sports car, arrived. She was a lawyer. McQueen thought Sally was pretty. But Sally just wanted McQueen to fix the mess he had made. The townsfolk agreed. They loved their town. So Sally and Doc made a deal. McQueen could leave after he fixed the road. But McQueen was still in a rush to get to his big race. So he worked too fast and made an even bigger mess of the messy road. A little while later, the town watched as Mater tried to drive on the new road, but the road was simply too bumpy. Doc was angry. He challenged McQueen to a race. If you win, you go and I fix the road, said Doc. If I win, you do the road my way. It certainly looked as if McQueen would win the race, but he didn't. He crashed into a cactus patch. Luckily, his new friend Mater helped him out. After that, McQueen learned a few things. He learned that the townsfolk were proud of their home. He learned why Sally loved Radiator Springs. And he learned that Doc had once been a champion race car. Finally, McQueen fixed the road. Then he thanked all his new friends by getting spiffed up, Radiator Springs style. Red, the fire truck, squirted McQueen clean. Guido and Luigi gave him new tires. 
Ramon gave him a new paint job. And Flo gave him a can of her best oil. By that night, the townsfolk had fixed their shops and their neon lights. The old town looked new again. Soon it was time to go back to the racetrack. But now McQueen had Doc as his crew chief. He also had a new pit crew. And they weren't just his teammates, they were his new best friends. Thanks for reading with Happy Cultivated. Please like this video and subscribe to our channel. Be sure you click the bell next to the subscribe button to be notified when we post new books. And for each book that we read, we create book-inspired art that you can hang in your bedroom, your playroom, or use it as a gift. Thanks for watching. Happy reading.